Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to share and publish projects in Visme, which is a cloud-based all-in-one visual content platform where you can create different types of content. In a previous video, I showed you how to create an infographic in Visme, and in this tutorial, I'll use it as an example to publish it online. So let me log into my Visme account. Here is the infographic project that I created. In the top right corner, you will see the share button. And if you click on it, you will see the share options. I'm going to cover these two options in this tutorial. When you use the publish for web option, your project is accessible by anyone and indexed by Google. On the other hand, Visme projects shared privately are only accessible by people you share them with. So let's look at the first option to share publicly. Click on this publish for web option. And in this dialog box, you can enter a title and a description. And finally, click Publish. Visme will generate a unique shareable link. You can use these social media buttons to share your infographic on any of these social media channels as well as via email. You can use this link to submit your infographic to the Visme gallery. And finally, you can use this view button to see how the infographic looks like after it's been published live, and this is how your viewers will also see it. Let's go back to the share option screen, and now I'll show you how to share your project privately. So when you click on this button, you will see this drop down menu with these two options. If you use this share with anyone option, anyone with the link can view your project. If you use the share with team option, only a team within Visme can view it. I'll choose the first option and click generate link. It will generate a unique URL which you can share. If you use this password option, anyone with whom you share this link will need to enter the password to view the project. Let's go back to the share option screen. Under advanced settings, you can control several other Publishing options. Under the Page Design tab, you can hide your profile, set mobile responsiveness, and page background. Under Display options, you can control animations. Under Social and Engagement, you can enable social sharing and comments. You can also collect leads using this registration option. And finally, under Audio Controls, you can control the audio in your project. In a separate tutorial, I'll show you how to embed your projects on a website or blog. You can try Visme for free. Check the link in the description section. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Look for more of my Visme tutorials. And thanks for watching.